tight. So I was up here in the loft the other day and the, someone was downstairs ringing the doorbell, but I couldn't hear it. So I figured, shoot, I think I have enough stuff to sort of make a doorbell uh, extender without actually changing out the doorbell. So I think I got it working, and this is the idea. So a doorbell just has like a transformer um, that steps down the 120 volts of your house down to like 24 volts or something like that. And uh, I figured if I could just sense th that there's a voltage on the line, I could have a little like an ESP8266 system on a chip sense that. And then since it's hooked to Wi-Fi, it could send the Wi-Fi signal up to my home assistant uh, setup. And then that could have an automation that sees that there's a doorbell going off and then uh, plays a sound through the stereo that's up here. So, uh, so it actually works. So that's what's going on here. This is, the, this is just a test transformer that I have. I'll have to adjust things a little bit when I put in the real doorbell because this is a six volt transformer. Anyway, and then this is a little circuit that's job is to just step down the AC here and make it a somewhere between zero and one volt, uh, which is what the ESP8266's uh, analog to digital converter can handle. So uh, here's a demo of it. So the transformer is just going to connect the circuit. This is like the doorbell. <laughs> and uh, it all worked. You can see I'm looking at the... This is the input signal. And then from my little, my little voltage divider with a diode, you can see I have a nice positive only current here. I wrote a little program on here that just says if there's anything over a threshold, just light it up. And the doorbell went off. Uh, it played the sound through the stereo. Everything's great. Let's try it again. And go. <laughs> I actually took that recording of the doorbell downstairs, so uh, it's like the same sound. Pretty convoluted, but definitely a good time. Enjoy.